what's going on youtube come back at you with another video okay so we got some breaking news apparently dark low has been arrested we don't know exactly at this point what he's been arrested for or what charges he's facing but i'm gonna show you what leak moss which is arab's brother has up on instagram he said free dark low shit crazy free low so again i wouldn't jump to conclusions at this point and automatically assume the dark low was arrested in connection with this whole conspiracy case but i will say um and i will explain to people out there who don't understand with the indictment that arab was hit with which is a superseding indictment the same type of indictment that six nine was hit with they don't need to um, individually file new indictments if other people's names come up during the course of their investigating and their course of their interrogating people that they already have in custody. Um, basically, if they come across information where they could add other people to certain counts, um, bring charges against them, all they need to do is put those people's names in the indictment that's already going on. So basically with this situation, we don't know because there's no paperwork online. I looked instantly when I saw this Instagram post, I went on the system to see if there was a new indictment released and there hasn't been at this point, which would basically lead me to two things. Either one, Dark Low was arrested on some completely separate charges outside of this conspiracy case or number two, there's other people who are yet to be arrested, have not been apprehended at this point, and they're going to be in the, involved in this as well, and that's why the feds didn't put it out. So those are the two options, basically, in my head. Either Dark Low um, wasn't arrested in connection with this case, or there's other people who are going to be arrested who haven't yet, so the feds are waiting to put that paperwork out with their names on it. So this is a crazy situation. I've been looking closely at everything as of recent connected to this court case. I will tell you some very interesting information that I'm going to bring forward in another video soon. But without question, at least one person in this case who I know by name is snitching and is cooperating and has given the feds um, quote unquote lengthy statements about this whole conspiracy and their involvement so um it's not looking good there's definitely people that have flipped and are working with the feds targeting some of these other people likely arab whoever else you know that they want to nail the most it would seem to me in this case though the feds are really coming for arab um i heard although i don't know how true this is that the offer that they came to ARAB with as far as getting any kind of deal in this was life. So the feds ain't trying to cut no deal. They're not trying to give him no kind of play, no, um, no love, nothing. They're trying to slam ARAB, it would seem to me. And some of these other people in this situation couldn't handle the pressure and are talking and have been talking for a long time. And I have the paperwork that's going to show everything. But this is a crazy situation. I'm hoping Dark Low not arrested in connection with this. We will know sooner rather than later, though, whether or not there's any paperwork that comes out with Dark Low's name on it. I don't know his actual government name. Um, otherwise, I could probably get some more information faster. But Leak Moss putting it out there, looking like Dark Low's been arrested. Let's see what people in these comments are saying. You see King Erner in there shaking my head. Um, tragedy, always something. Dudes out here snitching like Alpo, free dark low. And that's what happens in these Fed cases. Nine times out of ten, when people get indicted on these cases where they have co-defendants and things like that, um, the Feds, they have all the evidence. They come 
correct. When they come to lock somebody up, they come prepared. They come in it, with everything already planned out in advance. They know exactly what's going to happen in court. Pretty much the feds rarely lose because of how thorough they are with you know their investigation. This is the FBI you're talking about in this case who was doing a lot of the investigation. So they um they have information that is or evidence I should say that is pretty damning and people in this case know it and people in most fed cases know it and they end up cooperating to try to get a lenient sentence this is no different it's looking like again at least one of these people who I know by name is cooperating but we don't know how many other people are um this is a crazy case definitely um, interesting to see how this plays out and who else is arrested in connection to this. If indeed Dark Low was arrested in connection with this. So this is the news for right now. Anything else that I get from this whole situation, I will bring to you as it becomes available. Trial is actually going on right now, too. It started on Tuesday and now it's going to be continuing until there's um, verdicts in this case, but I will keep you in tune with everything I can. It's kind of crazy. The media actually has not been covering this case at all. I don't even see it in the local Philly news. Nowhere that I'm looking is bringing information as to actually what's happening in this courtroom. And it's a sad thing because we're actually missing out on some very interesting information, but anything I find I'll bring to you. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I appreciate you watching. Make sure you hit the like. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure if you're subscribed, you ring the bell. Appreciate you, though. Peace.